Hey guys, it's Teaching Miss Fashion, and this week I got a quick product review and a styling session. Now, for the product that, that I'm reviewing, it's a company called Dragon Inside. It's an MTM clothier, and the suit that I have on, this three-piece, is from their webs I mean, from their store. I just want to show you the fit real quick. I, as you can see, it's an impeccable fit. Now, this is the really good thing about this store, because if you've ever shopped MTM, I'm pretty sure you know that usually the first suit won't come out perfect. There is a couple flaws and then you'll fix your measurements and by the second suit you probably will have a perfect suit. The interesting part is that from Dragon Inside the suit came out perfect the first time. I've never ordered there before but the suit as you can see I mean I wouldn't change anything about it. Now I think what really helped was that not only do they take body measurements they also take um, measurements from a previous suit that you own that you feel fits very well sorry, very well and they also ask for three pictures. So they take all that into consideration in building this masterpiece. Now, for the styling session, I'll be teaching you guys how to style a three-piece. Now, a lot of people fear the three-piece because they think it's um, too uptight or maybe too serious. But there are some unconventional ways that you can pull it off and it might change your perspective on this certain item. The interesting part, or the what I feel is good about a three-piece is that it has a lot of versatility, especially now for the winter months when it gets really cold, you throw on this extra layer, the vest, and it warms you up a little bit more. So, and when it gets warm, you just ditch the vest. Now this is an interesting concept because you can do the same vice versa. Okay, so like I said, you can ditch the vest. It's, let's say it's a really hot day, you ditch the vest, now you have a two-piece, looks good. And like I said, vice versa, ditch the jacket, and just keep the vest for a more casual feel. Now this is where it starts getting interesting. I like to call this me method the odd piece. And this is where you just, you switch the vest from the original outfit or from the original suit and you throw in an odd vest, a vest that contrasts the suit, the original suit. Now with the same odd vest, play on and make your own three piece. Use the suit jacket from the original three piece and just throw it on top. This is where I told you, um, this odd piece concept comes in where you switch or swap out a piece from the original three piece and throw in a contrasting one. All right now this um, style or uh, tip that I'm giving you guys can't only or isn't only limited to the vest. You can actually do this with your suit jacket. So go back to the original vest, original pants and now throw in a suit jacket, a contrasting one from another suit. Now this concept really helps you guys out because if you have one three-piece and one contrasting color suit from that three-piece, you can play on with it like I am right now. The same way that I just did this with the suit jacket, and you can actually do, do it with the trouser as well. Keep the suit jacket from the original, the vest from the original three-piece, and throw on maybe the suit pants from this suit. Same thing, it'll look good and it'll give you more versatility and your wardrobe. So as you saw with my previous outfits, the three-piece concept doesn't have to be constrained to the original three-piece that you originally had. You can actually mix and match. And the good thing about this is, like I said, that if you have one contrasting suit and one three-piece, that contrasts that three-piece, sorry, and a bunch of shirts and ties, you can construct a whole wardrobe around that, those two suits. And now also keep in mind that I used the same interior, meaning the same shirt and tie throughout all the outfits. So if I had switched it up, they wouldn't even look anywhere or nearly this, like the same suits. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tip and uh, like my video. If you did, remember to hit, hit the like button. Helps me out, helps me know that you guys liked it. Uh, reaches more men. Subscribe, I try to put out videos every week and thank you for watching.